Hey guys, Orange Juice here. Um, today I'm going to show you some more advanced um, display things for your items. So before I showed you like the basics of names and lore, but this time I'm going to try to get into uh, a little more detail. And I might mess up a lot during this video, so oh well, I don't really care. All right, so um, the reason why I wanted to make this video is because I was trying to learn how to like get colored names and colored lore and uh, all sorts of like new formatting types um, so yeah here's a basic tutorial so we're going to start with the give command again we're going to do give at s and for the sake of this video I'll just use a diamond sword um, because that's always nice so remember we're going to open the nbt and then we're going to type display and then name and so this is where it's becoming a little different from my previous video instead of uh actually i, I kind of forgot it's like something like this or whatever yeah you had this um we're going to change this so we're going to do two single quotes and then within them we're going to add some more curly brackets and then here is where we're going to put text so actually it's going to be a little different but just follow me um we're just going to do um uh within these um uh double quotes we're going to write text and then uh, we'll do colon and then within more double quotes. We're gonna add high um, And then we we can also change the color here so we can do color and then I'll make this I think aqua is a color So yeah, you can look there and it was actually the color aqua. There's all sorts of things. So there's um, These are more formatting types. There's obfuscated bold italic strike through and underline So I'll go through each one real quick um, we'll remove the color, we'll do obfuscated, and then, um, you don't have to have the double quotes, um, unless it's, uh, something besides true or false, so here I'll just write true without the quotes, and you can see you get this, like, nice, like, random thing, if you look in text right here, it's weird, I think it's, I think that might be a glitch, I'm not actually sure, but it's, <laughs> it's pretty fun. To like troll your friends with. Um, next, we're going to do bold. Um, so I'll just go through all of these real quick. So just like that, you can see here. Here's bold. Uh, here's italic. It's already a, um, italics right now. I can actually make that false, and then you can you can see what that's like. Italic. And I'll change this to false. So yeah, it's just straight up and down. So you can kind of see all these here. Um, so yeah, you can change a lot of that. But now I'm going to actually uh, change this up a little bit. I'm going to put these in brackets. So these square brackets, they represent an array in Minecraft, meaning you can have like, you can have multiple things in them. So this is just one thing within the curly brackets. So uh, we're going to add a comma, and then we're going to, uh, we can add something else. So we can say text um, by. Alright, and then let me remove the italics real quick. As you can see, you can get high by. Um, so that might not mean too much at first, but that way you can actually get multicolored stuff. So we can do color green. Oh, don't forget your quotes. And then we have to change, we actually have to change it here too. So if you just did this, then it will make everything after it green unless specified otherwise. So we'll do color and then you can do blue or something like that. Um, and then if you see uh, that didn't work, why not? Because we forgot our quote and then there we go. Yeah, so you have to be very specific. This language is not very forgiving, um, so yeah. Um, and then we can also add like some kind of weird like text. We'll do AK. Um, then you can have obfuscated. And then true. So you get this. It's really weird. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's going on here, but yeah, you can do something like that. I'm actually gonna give myself a command block because it's gonna get harder and harder to type out these commands because they're getting so long so basically what i'm going to do is i'll get 
I'll just use a button. I'll copy this. No, actually, no. I'll just do something new in here. So we changed up the name. Um, we're going to also change up the lore because the lore can also be changed. Um, so let's type in display. Uh, we'll, be, we'll just do lore for now. Um, so you, you have these square brackets to represent an array again. Um, and in here, we're going to use single quotes. And then we can do the same thing as the name. We can do text and then I or something like that. And then hopefully, yeah, you get the display uh, lore and then it says hi. Um, but these are, um, these are in square brackets. And so that means we can actually add multiple lines into the lore. So we can do text and then by again. And then that should hopefully get you high by. But if you want to get even more uh, complex, you can add square brackets to here and here. And then um, remember, these represent an array. So you can have one line have multiple things. So I'm going to see if I can get this right the first time. <laughs> this took many tries because it's annoying. Um, so we'll just do bye. Um, and then you get hi bye. So yeah, you can add um, you can add this and then add this again in the name uh, in an array. And then you can have multiple uh, colors or multiple formatting types. So we'll change the color to uh, I don't know, dark blue. And then just like that, you can get multicolored stuff. And then remember, you can just play around with this. There's all sorts of things you can add. Um, we'll just have, uh, we'll have this obfuscated. And then you can also make it bold. Sure, why not? And then, yeah, you just get this crazy mess. It's really weird. Let's go ahead and change up the name, if you remember. Let's just run through it one last time. So we'll do name. Um, uh, and then we add the two quotes. Um, I'm going to put this in an array so we can have multiple on one line. Text, uh, uh We'll change the color to... Uh, aqua or something and then oh, you need your quotes and then we can go in here change text to IDK lol um, and then we can change color to black and then we'll also make this underlined so underlined uh, Okay, I think this might work. Uh, oh yeah, it's really hard to see the black. Let me actually change it. Um, we'll make it an, an ugly sort of green color. Uh, and yeah, there you go. You get this really crazy text thing. Uh, I don't know. But that's there if you want to do it. Um, and yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video at any moment uh, you should if you need to pause it you probably should it's pretty hard to uh, it's pretty hard to think about but if you just think about like all the all like just the basic text and then um, whatever the, this is hard ah, okay you know what just pause and you'll do great. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, uh, leave a comment down below. It's kind of hard to understand, but uh, you'll get it eventually, just like me, um, through a couple of tears um, and blood and sweat. So yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like and subscribe. See you later.